excited to see what Josh Sheehan will do here in round number one. Five X Games appearances in three different disciplines. But he does have the double back really, in his arsenal really tricks as well. Success or failure motivates me more. When I first started, I just saw the possibilities and thought, oh, I'd like to learn that. And so then that drove me to, you know, to succeed, to overcome fears, to learn new things, just to progress. What motivates me a lot is thinking about what's possible, thinking about where I can be, where I want to be. I am from a very competitive family, so <laughs> I love a challenge and you know, when you're just doing something for yourself at small jobs or whatever, it might not be so rewarding, but when there's a competition, when you can beat someone else, you don't want to fail because it can be scary, it can be nerve-wracking, but all that adds up and fuels the fire and that's what makes it good. It wasn't until I was about three or four years into freestyle motocross that I realised that it was a career but I was just always thinking do my best try and beat people and I wasn't thinking of the career aspect and I think that's what helped me get there it was just the, the passion and, and love for it. I've got a passion for motorsports anything with a motor really you know two wheels four wheels just love thrashing cars bikes and always have since a little kid so got into bikes and I just fell in love and I love doing jumps, I love being in the air, so I like planes and skydiving, things like that, and it just goes together. You know, get the adrenaline rushing and uh, I think that's what keeps me going. You know, you can just forget about the world and just ride the bike and have fun. Being strong and fit is crucial to what we do. If you're not fit, if you get an injury, it can put you out and if it's bad enough it'll end your career then that can affect your mentality you can then be depressed and it can suck just just an injury sucks when you're off the bike you know, or if you're out of your job whatever for a couple of months being strong and fit is both good for the body to take any hits to keep you healthy but also to keep you mentally healthy and i think it's fair to say that i don't really mentally train for competition i train for life i try and be competition ready but all the time. I try and do a lot of brain exercises, uh, juggling, and you know, our brains are, are capable of so much. And in this sport, I, I do enjoy pushing myself and challenging myself. X Games is massive for action sports athletes because for us, it's like the, the pinnacle of action sports and it's a bit surreal that you're, you're up against these other people, the best in the world, but then you think, yeah, if I'm here, like, it's possible, you know. I've got what it takes to battle against these guys and the longer you have to train or the longer you have to work towards something, the more rewarding the goal is. To get a gold medal at X Games, it's like that. It's the one competition all year. Travelling, training, doing all this stuff to, to get there and then to take home a gold after all of that is just a massive weight off your shoulder and it's like you're on cloud nine for you know, for days after. There's a lot more to think about with some tricks. The way the bars are turned, the wheels are spinning, it affects the way the bike rotates in the air. So you need to do a little bit of research beforehand and if you can visualise it, if you can understand the science behind what happens with the bike, how everything works, then the easier you can master a challenge. Everything seems hard, everything seems impossible or very difficult until you see someone else do it and then all of a sudden it looks easy. And then people set so many limits for themselves, they, they lie to themselves and convince themselves that you know, they have this problem or they can't do this or that this certain thing is impossible. Sometimes you need to give it a crack or make an effort, see what you can do and everything's closer than we think, we just set our own barriers. Ooh.